Well, good noon, guys. It is uh, Saturday, January 5th. Happy 2019. I'm Gunarm Dine. Call me Dine. And I wanted to do something uh, quick before Final Fantasy V. And I wanted to start that after AGDQ. Mega Man had recently defeated Dr. Wily once again, and was enjoying some peaceful days with Dr. Light, Roll, and the others. I'll finish my explanation after the intro. However, like always, this piece wouldn't last long. In a desperate move to catch everyone off guard, Dr. Wily quickly cut off his own sentence, repaired and upgraded eight of his old robot masters, namely the ones... He forced Dr. Cossack to send after Mega Man so many years ago because he obviously ran out of funding with all those giant machines. And this, this graphic was taken from Mega Man and 9. Having failed with his fake robots, viruses, and disguises, Dr. Wily decided it was time to try sheer speed in order to take over the world. So this is an unofficial sequel to Mega Man 10. With reused graphics from Mega Man 4, but then again, this is, well, this is a hack-up. Mega Man once again had to prepare himself for a journey, a voyage, around the world to stop the evil robots from wreaking havoc. And if our final boss ends up being M. Bison, we're playing the wrong game. He also knew that he would have to locate Dr. Wily himself, hiding... in one of his many skull castles. What, a, what nasty surprises await Mega Man... this time around. So yeah, I wanted to do a quickie before Final Fantasy V, start Final Fantasy V after AGDQ, and since I'm racing with LPH tonight, this is the best time to play through this, so I'm hoping to actually beat it in one go. Yeah, this is Mega Man 4 Voyage, a ROM hack of Mega Man 4. It uh, changes up a lot of the game, uh, new levels, uh, new boss AI, and new music. No, uh, HM Music, this is not out of the Legacy Collection, this is a ROM hack that was just released within the last week or two. Let's go ahead and jump right in. So, we've got some new music. Uh, I actually don't know how much of this is arranged from other games or is original. But I'm gonna go ahead and try my usual boss order. Helps to have a shorter boss intro. Ah, water and sand. Two things that Anakin Skywalker hates the most. Now, you think that platform would actually do something. Yep. Okay, we, we've got nothing but saw blades so far. And spike pits right at the very beginning of the game. This is going to be one of those hacks, isn't it? On the plus side, I do kind of like the, this new song for Die Man stage. That's all I know, there aren't too many of those. I won't complain too much. And more spikes. What is it with... Ah... <sighs> uh, I need Rush Marine to get through there, so remind me to come back here later. Yep, pl plenty of spike pit... Uh, bad memories. And that, that is always a bad sign in a Mega Man hack when they decide, oh, we're going to throw spikes everywhere. No, that is not good design. And holy crap, that took a lot of health. That was going to be a tricky jump. Okay, am I out of the spike pit? Oh! Yeah. Well, I pushed the jump on a little too hard by accident on that one. Of course, the one thing I'm worried about is this is the updated AI make them um, e easier or harder. We will find out if I make it to the boss without a game over. <laughs> 
Well, I'm, I'm off to such a good start here. Yeah, it's not that bad, really, but uh, so so many so many spikes at the start are not good first impressions. So it, it's just one of those things that uh, can kind of turn people away at the start. Yep. Unfortunately, those drill fish only come out once. And it looks like this is, works like the Mega Man 5, where if you take a hit, you lose your Buster Charge. Seeing plenty of enemies from other Mega Man titles as well. Negative beat for one. Oh no. Oh. Well! <laughs> Severed robot heads! So they only pop out of the pit once, so long as their spawn point doesn't... ...doesn't go back off screen. Oh, man. Gotta watch out for damage. Oh, no! Half this level has been spike ceiling so far! Could be worse, there aren't any in here. Just a little bit of platforming. So not bad, not bad. Okay, and the end. Oh, only one mini-boss. I've got to accept that. Let's see if I can be Dive Man without... Oh! Fuck you, game. Okay, so Dive Man moves a lot slower. Youch. And he's gonna drop down from from above, right? No, nope. holy cow. Yeah, let's try again with full health. It's not, it's not like I accidentally pressed the wrong button or anything right there. <laughs> Fortunately, I got a few extra lives to try that again. Ah, turn around, Eggman. I didn't have a full charge! Okay, the one the one thing that's tricky about this is uh, the the Buster is not is it's not buffering. I'll, I'll say. And I'm not turning around properly, so I'm gonna die again. Okay, so he's pulling me in. Ugh. So I just gotta just gotta take it calm, take out the homing in missiles. I should be fine. Yeah, turning around just seems to take a little bit. Ah. Gotta remember to turn around so I can actually shoot the bastard. So I, I'm currently ahead in terms of health. I can I can probably beat eat him if I don't do that. Not good, not good, not good. Ah I think that was my last life. Yep. Okay. Ah, uh, let's try a different boss. Let's go with the... I can't beat any other robot mask with just the Buster boss, a.k.a. Toad Man. And obviously it's snowing in this level now, it's simply raining. Ice physics in Toad Man stage. Thank you, game. I, I will say this, this, the music is excellent so far. No, those, pengu those penguins are in Toad Man stage in the original game. What am I thinking? I'm thinking of the hopping ones from Gemini Man.
And go to the frogs from Bubble Man stage. Oh, we got one more. Yeah, this is weird because I can't turn around unless I let go of one button and push the other. Yeah. I'd like some health drops, though, game. So yeah, my only... I, I can say my only complaint, really, aside from the spikes and dive man stage, is the controls are a little bit tighter than they were previously. And that's not a good thing. Just something to get used to, at the very least. Actually, use, use, use the turning around to the advantage there with the ice physics. It worked out nicely. Not quite a puzzle room, just a... Uh... Just have to work our way around to get to the platforming. Ah, I knew this guy was going to show up sooner or later. This is told me on stage, after all. Okay, we got shrapnel from bombs. So that made that guy a little trickier. Not difficult. Oh, hi, Eddie. Ah. He stopped further along than I wanted to. Oh. Okay, sudden, sudden spikes. Uh. I'm not suddenly playing Celeste, am I? A little bit in concentration mode here, but no longer need. This isn't Charade Man stage either, but fortunately those guys can't climb ladders, apparently. Oh, you don't look familiar. What Mega Man game are you from? Are we still in Toad Man stage, by the way? The ice physics are all gone! <laughs> Rip Fan Man. Okay. Just when I thought those hornets from Mega Man 3 couldn't get it any more annoying. <laughs> I'll take out the horn at first and foremost. Wish I had a vertical weapon though. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, if I want to have multiple lives for a boss, I will gladly take that. Just have to get to the bloody thing first. Oh, so so the slinky enemy maybe for Mega Man 8. That's the current that's the current guess from chat. Okay, let's not let's not get curb stomped by a hornet again. I get you to spawn so I can. There we go. Ah! 
My large health! If the actual boss is Airman, I quit. Now, let's see if Toad Man, how Toad Man plays up against his previous self. What? I, I, heard, I heard a buzz. Oh, great, he's pooping on me. Okay, so don't shoot him when his, when his arms are raised up. Oh, how did I dodge that? Woohoo! First try! <laughs> so, he's a little more mobile. He has a secondary attack. Just don't shoot him when his arms are up. He won't drop rain flush on you. So, not too bad. One down. So we got, yep, right, still rain flush. And is that our rush marine? Yes, okay. So when I do dive man stage again, I'll take that a shorter path again. I'll, I'll try that shorter path. <laughs> 